are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Tuesday, August 4th. I'm James Spann. Got a few small isolated showers across the state today. Most places dry. And the weather here looks pretty quiet for a while. Let's take a look. Here's the upper air look across the country today. Once again, a fairly deep upper trough over the eastern states for this time of the year. And there's the visible satellite view. Got a few pockets of convection across the northern half of the state, but not many. For most locations, the sky is partly to mostly sunny. That was the radar at 222, and you can see a few isolated showers, mainly over the northern half of the state. They're small. They're not lasting long. Most locations dry. Temperatures below average, nobody griping about that. Readings mostly between 85 and 90. Birmingham sitting at 85. The uh, hot spot is Utah and Centerville over in West Alabama. They've got 92. There's the watch warning map. We've got tropical storm warnings, flash flood warnings, and a tornado watch for the northeast United States with ECES. As that is on the way out finally this afternoon. Otherwise, things are quiet down here. An enhanced risk of uh, severe storms around New York City and Long Island this afternoon with a tropical system. Also a chance of severe storms for the western high plains through tonight. Tomorrow, again, a risk of severe storms over eastern Colorado and some of the adjacent states. And on day three, Thursday, no organized severe weather expected across the country. Rain for the next seven days. Bigger numbers today up in the northeast with Isaias. For our state, just not much. Under a quarter of an inch between now and Tuesday morning of next week. And speaking of Isaias... Winds are down to 40 miles per hour. This will be a tropical depression probably by the time you watch this coming up through the northeastern states. Headed toward eastern Canada. That will be dissipating in coming days. Still a chance of a few tornadoes and those spiral bands wrapping around the system. But again, um, it's just about over. And next out in the Atlantic, our next system, Invest 94L, which is south-southwest of Bermuda, just about fizzling because of very dry air. It's there, but again, I just don't think that's going to be an issue. The rest of the Atlantic Basin is very quiet right now. But remember, September is coming. Uh, the peak of the season is this month and next month as well, so we are far from done. So, model fans, here we go. The GFS, the 12Z run, valid tomorrow at 4. Again, broad troughing over the east, and like today, there could be a few very small isolated showers, but probably not many. Highs 87 to 90, the sky partly to mostly sunny. Same thing Thursday and the same thing Friday. Lots of sunshine. Heat levels creeping up. We'll probably see low 90s uh, Thursday and Friday. Lots of sunshine. This is Saturday, and this is Sunday. Evidence moisture might be a little higher Sunday over the Tennessee Valley, but again, uh, widespread rain, no. Highs for the weekend, mostly low 90s. The sky partially sunny. Monday of next week, partly sunny, isolated showers. And a week from today, Tuesday, the 11th of August, the heights are coming up. So hot, humid, and moisture levels are increasing next week. So we'll bring back the chance of random, scattered afternoon and evening storms. That's what you expect this time of the year. Let's go out 10 days. This is Friday of next week, August 14th. 591 ridge on top of us, and again, classic summer weather. Partly sunny, hot, muggy, a few spots getting a storm. Rain for Birmingham off the GFS Ensemble. The mean around two inches. You can see the rain chances ticking up after about a week. Highs 90 to 95, lows mostly in the upper 60s and low to mid 70s for a while. And the CPC outlook August 12th through August 18th. Again, showing temperatures maybe a little above average around here. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.